Praise God, praise God. This is Apostle Deanna Dixon. I'm primarily doing this live because of all you that are on YouTube. Praise God. I hope you can see. Um, as you know, we did the 2020 Vision of God Conference in Atlanta at the Renaissance Hotel, which is a very beautiful hotel. And the staff, some of the staff that work with me, they were saved, you guys. Oh, my God. I didn't even tell about that testimony. The event coordinator and also the um, the manager, the, the manager and eventer event coordinator as well. Um, we couldn't wait to meet each other. So when we saw each other the day of, we just hugged each other like twice. I mean, so this was such a blessed event. And uh, I'm not going to say event. I don't like event. It was a blessed ministry um, to where God was just doing what he had to do. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. And I had no idea to the extent, but I knew the warfare was great. Every time I get a co give a conference or whatever, the warfare is always great. But this one was the greatest, I must say. Like I said earlier, there were so many things that happened. So I wanted to get up on here and show you that all um, our YouTube, the pictures. Um, this is me and the poop. This is the first one. And she was so, she was so sweet. Um, these people, their lives were changed. It wasn't about a show. Um, they liked the idea that I was touchable because every last one of them that wanted prayer, I prayed with them. Um, praise God. But I do have something to say about that. Um, everyone wanted me to pray with them. I want you guys to understand something. I, I thank you, Lord. I, I, I thank you. I thank you that you believe in me. I thank you that, you know, you want me to touch you or whatever the case may be. But I pray for the next conference that if there's other ministers there that I trust, that I know that have the spirit of God, let them pray for you. Because guess what? They have it too. I, I think we have to understand that you don't know who God is going to use. And again, I don't mind praying for everybody. I, I want that to be understood. But Everyone that was there wouldn't let anyone else pray for them but me. And so I had long lines and I didn't mind. I did not mind. Don't get it twisted. But I just want everybody to be mindful that God is using everybody in this hour. I promise you he is. Come on, somebody. And the person that you may least suspect might have that word, might have that miracle in their hand. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. So let me go ahead. But but I do understand. I want y'all to know you come from a long way. I get it. You follow me. I get it. And I thank you for that. So let me go ahead and show you some of the pictures that someone took. And I thank God they took pictures. It was 50 people that were prayed for and baptized. And it was just, it was just beautiful. They even had little bitty ones. <laughs> uh, you know, small. I mean... But most of them were young people. I was astonished at that because my following is mostly predominantly what I thought was older people. Maybe it's changing. Praise God. All right. Let's see. I'm trying to go to the next picture. Okay. All right. Okay. I went too far. And this is for my YouTube family. So this is another picture. And so they had some on each side of the pool. This is the other side. And then this one. I don't know why it's taking so long to get to the picture here. Maybe I got to go back the other way. Okay, wait a minute, y'all. I'm sorry. All right. Okay. And this is me uh, actually at the conference talking to a youth, praying with her. This is a um, picture of the youth. They, we had asked them to come to the front. Praise God. This is the first picture again. I'm going to have to go through them again, apparently. Like I just got to, I'm click happy, y'all. I got to learn how to stop clicking so much. This was the first line, you guys. And actually, they cut off the line with the picture. It was people way down there. You understand what I'm saying? And so I had my armor bearer, and this is me kind of cut off. And I prayed with them before they got baptized as well. Um, they brought people even in a wheelchair. So, and again, this is not to glorify myself. Look what God is doing. Forget Deanna. That's right. I'm Deanna. I'm a servant Deanna. Uh, yeah, we have titles and gifts, but I'm Deanna. And I'm telling you, this is just the beginning that said the Lord. He said he's getting ready to do in every city and every state. Will you be available? Thus said the Lord. Our next city will be Jackson, Mississippi. Jackson, Mississippi. I'm putting that together right now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. And I just want you to know that God is doing something in this hour like never before. Praise God. But I went through so much spiritual warfare that day. I'm not even going to speak on that all the way. I can't. But 
it was some things that happened. I didn't understand. I do now. This is what it was all about. That's why Satan tried to divide and conquer and start foolishness. You know, Satan tries to divide us. That's what he does in this hour. He's trying to divide us. But can I tell y'all something? We better learn to come together like never before. Forgive each other. Understand. And communication, you guys. Communication is your best friend. Sometimes it's not what it looks like. Sometimes it's not what it is. It is. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. Uh, it's the body of Christ. God was telling me just today, we got to slow down being angry and enraged. Sit down and listen some time and hear what God's saying. Hear what the spirit of God is saying. Because at the end of the day, you know what it's about? It's about souls. I don't know why my computer is taking long like that. It's, this, is, this is what it's about. It's about souls, not Deanna. Not, it's about praying for our youth, praying for people. And it's about souls. I'm trying to go back to the, this is what it's about. At the end of the day, this is what it's about. Not you, not me, but a soul, a soul, a soul, said the Lord. That's what this is about. It ain't about being grand, being the best apostle, the best prophet, the best teacher. But can you reach people? Hallelujah. Even when you're going through. Because I'm going to be honest with you. I have been in ministry 24 years and I had never been under the warfare for this conference as I was. And it cost me more than you know. My God, my God, my God. Hallelujah. But I promise you, I ain't going to stop. I can't stop. Because it's not about us. Um, praise God. And I'm going to tell you all why we was dipping kind of quick too. They lied to us. They told us that that water that was a, a heated pool. That was that was cold. Then it was cold outside, and I didn't want people to get sick. And they were adamant. They were adamant about getting baptized. And I was like, "This water cold." And so I was like, "And, and I'm not gonna lie to you. I got sick afterwards." Um, as a matter of fact, I'm in the name of Jesus. I'm healed right now. I'm you know. I, oh my God! It's been what since Monday. I mean, blah blah blah. That's all I can tell you. And I'm still drinking on Theraflu and stuff. But it was worth it. If that makes sense to you, it was worth it getting that cold. It was worth it. It was worth it. All of it. All the pain, all the sorrow, all the stuff that Satan did, which he think he did because God know how to turn it around. Hallelujah. So these were the pictures for people that are on YouTube. Again, our next healing and deliverance meeting will be in Jackson, Mississippi. Um, I'm going to give a date and a time. And I'm telling you, 50 souls, 50 souls. And, and hold on, it ain't about the number. Because even, even if it had been one, that's souls. That's, that's what I want y'all to hear. I pray to God y'all listen to me. Hallelujah. So I pray um, that you are moved because that's what God was telling me. He said, Deanna, I allow revival to hit. And he told me, because notice it was the 2020 vision of God. God wants revival to hit in every city, every state, every church, every home. Hallelujah. Praise God. All right, so this is Apostle Deanna Dixon, Roll Our Soldiers, for that is who we are. God bless.